When winter's eve draws snell and dour And creeps towards the lousing hour The moon keeks through the fading licht The market's closing down for nicht When borealis cold brief blaws To smoor the loans with drifting snaws Here, in icy grip no less Lie the streets of Inverness where any night you'll find old Tam partaking of his evening dram. But this winter's eve was one exception, for Tam jaloused a cold reception. Should he gang him birlin to the wife, hence risk it beef his limb and life, right will he fear don glower and look, her lashing tongue and deft left hook. And so, to save a fear fate, Domestic pagger, free his workplace, Tam did swagger. Oh, no, for Tam to bus or hike, he went by trusted motorbike. Had you he seen sick drumly nicht? You wouldn't yourselves he done it. Great dodds asleep come swirling down and melt it on his bonnet. But he hadn't gang far down the street when cruel misfortune he did meet. He breenged aff richt into a dyke, and the wheels come fleeing aff his bike. Tam waste that beggars mona be choosers, so high tailed it for the nearest boozers. But he had na gang far down the street, when Johnny the Dram he did meet. Wem say by that moniker is kenned, for drinking drammies days and end. Och, he and Tam was just like brothers, they'd been in money's a bevy session together. For just one mare they should na swither. Fe frying their brains and stewing their livers. John spying Tam's form through blizzard squall, his bond homie did engender. When he roared on Ken's speckled cry, Tam, my boy, we're out in a bender. The storm abin might roar and whistle. They set their course by glen and thistle, by water front and clachnahari, then turnwards back to crack and tarry, by Phoenix. And MacGregor's bar we doon the hatch and slange of ar, by Black Isle Bar and Hoot and Annie's, chatting up birds they did na ken were trannies, till in the end they did descend upon a gloomy market lane, where lamplight ghosts through iron grill, there stands the ancient market inn, unchanged since the days of Culloden Moor, as you can tell by the condition of the furniture. Into the reeking raucous room, the drithy stackered through the gloom, as Tam and John did fairly gop, at the entertainment on a table top. A piano box was honking and dirling, some Celtic gadgy was yellicking and skirling. O Tam had jade but been nay undone, by fortune's cruel mishanter. And body swerved this drunken hooly and went home to Mrs. Ashanter. She told the wheel that thou was a stunkert, half daft useless pish he'd drunkert, and for January first to end December was scarce a nicht thou could remember. She prophesied with scalding talks, thou would be drowned in Muirton locks, or for a cert thou would be slain by bogley men on Craig Denane. Outside the har came swirling down, a pea suit plaid to hap the tune. Ach, to do some ways, our tam was scant. He relished in this barroom rant. The nicht drave on, we crack and sang, the chorus rose, the last bell rang, with stories, tunes, and cracks and rhymes. They parted wheel past closing time. O oh, tam felt glee and blissful solace, then stopped at the sicht of the local polis. Muckle, brawny, bold and brash, and five foot nine across the moustache. He stood with truncheon gripped in hand. Time up, clear out, was his command, as the punters fled to lane frae bar, and smoored in Murray's swirling har, as in the black December nicht, dwine aff with fading soon and sicht. As up on high Kirk's ancient tower, the clock clicks to the witching hour. As high in Belnook Hulet's skellochs, amid the drunken sangs and yellochs, 
Then keeks to see the blazing thrang On Kirkgate's ancient causes gang At Kirkyard Yetts they dare na loiter And ram along where Rochel stoiter Now, drunken indeed our intrepid pair They still reserved resource foo flair And easing tam's impending quam By repairing his bike with the wheels of a pram and so the bike rode worthy, as good as they mon macker, till John discovered a technical hitch. Tam was facing backwards. Kings may be blessed, but Tam was pished. He bluttered out into the mist. <laughs> oh, Tam, oh, Tam, had ye the vision to contemplate your next decision. Troth, thou was bothered by the goad, a polis hiding by the road, and way the sleek at waste can Ivan. To ambush thee for drunken driving. And so he takes the lang road home across the brae by Craig Dunane. By Newton Locks and up the brae the trusty cycle went, whilst glowering round for polis cars and singing a Gallic lament. The throbbing roar went rat one hour by stately fir and gothic tower, when onward. Through the trees he drove Into the deep, dark, gloomy grove The ewood soon was drawing nigh Where ghosts of legend nichtly cry When glimmering through the groaning trees The forest seemed all in a bleeze Through ilk abore the beams were glancing And loud resumed at mirth and dancing Oh, fearless, bald, inspiring drink What twisting fates thou fair can link as often times in retrospect will shack the heedest thoughts collect of fearsome deeds the nicht afore, we shudder to the very core. Inspiring bold John Barleycorn, what dangers thou canst make us scorn. We Ushkebeha, we'll fear nae evil, we buck fast tonic, we'll face the devil. The madness blazed in Tammy's noddle, he shook it at his quarter bottle. And stopped to bite by glimmering bower, face lit by briefest sheer skewer, then creep at four and horns and knees, on snow thick grun atwixt the trees, then glake it gulped, at sicht abhorrent, the ghastly scene that streets the forum, ayont the trees, through misty hoch, a kelly on a frozen loch, and queer a rake of chills and quines, hags and ghouls of every kind. Warlocks, witches, evil fairies, bogley bows and peery wearies, carlins, kelpies, droichs and buddies, wraiths and ghosts and heedless hoodies. The har was pierced with chilling moans, and on the freezing nicht air drones, a skeleton piper's o' a dirl, chanter eerie peabrook skirl, a demon on a baran thumped, a jerky four four real time stump. Piping, drumming, whistling, fiddling, reeling, rhyming, dancing, diddling. Tam got to gasp with yawning gub, for it minded him fine of the White Heather Club. Oh, hell, men, what fate our Tam betides, and oh, what antrin sichts besides. There was a Jacobite soldier in agonised throes, with Cumberland's musket boss smashed through his nose. A team of black horses and training a hearse. A red coat with a claymore jammed up his ears. There was a revenant dentist with smoke in his brief. He'd gassed up his victims and hout out their teeth. And dozens besides, the foul and the evil, to even describe, would be doing right uncivil. Here Tammy gazed, gobsmacked and wondrous. The mirth and fun grew wild and thunderous. The pipers loud and faster skirled, the dancers twisted, hooked and burled, hickety pickety healy yaleary, heard them dirdum tatsal teary, when in the ram stam tam did spy, an uncle sichty please his eye, a brawly carl and wild and wicket, stripped a willow scuddy naked, tam louted and laughed with raucous fits, as she shimmied her shuggled her jiggly bits, then tinty reason tam did yell, Nae bother, darling, on your cell. <gasps> Scarcely had he finished roaring when out the hellish band came pouring. His bees buzzed out with angry fake, 
till Tam get moot on his bike. We pound and brain and feeble hurt it. We muckle welly the engine stert it. So Tam drives on the witch's folly. We mony an eldritch screech unholy. Now, do thy trust the utmost bike. Gang roaring doon space rocket like. We throttle through gang screaming for. And win the licht to the psychiatric hospital door. There at them thy twa fingers ye may toss. That institution's entrance they dare my cross. The pursuance there they'll sure mon quit it. For they ken damn fine they'd be admitted. The naked Carlin, four afore the rest, hoard upon the noble motorcycle pressed. She flew at Tam with furious ettle, then burnt her horn in scalding nettle. Tam, trembling like a stricken gate, cries, Holy mince, she's grabbed the pipe. With final twist the throttle scream, and jolted Tam into the gleam, and in the black December night, securely bathed in psychiatric hospital licht. Tam takes one last look turn and run, at the naked carlin in the rim of the gloom. She glowered through the nichtly calm, then stuck twa fingers up at Tam, then off into the darkness cantered. Clutch in the exhaust pipe of Tamashanter, as the hellish legion slithered him to the deepest nooks of Craig Dunne. Now, what this tale of truth may hear, then log in good and hae nae fear, for to finalise I shall dispense a line or twa of common sense. Whenever to the drink yous are inclined, or a three-day session's on your mind, just call canny and keep the heed like, and remember the tale of old Tam and his motorbike.